So, uh, you yeah, know, just really pleased uh, and proud of our football team. Pleased for them. Proud of the uh, performance they gave today. Certainly, I thought they played a lot of determination out there, a lot of discipline, a lot of decisiveness. And uh, you know, we walked into a, what was a very challenging environment, a you know, big contrast from last week. A lot of fronts, weather, the environment itself, not being a night game, all that type of thing. And, uh, you know, still had some injuries to overcome on top of it. But uh, just really pleased with the way, the way the guys fought through all that. Uh, experienced some bumps early in the game, first half. Uh, some things that didn't go quite as we had hoped, maybe. Uh, the defense kept playing. They came uh, right from the start and played good football and kept us in the game. And then certainly in the second half, uh, you know, it was just a really strong performance by everybody involved offensively. Ran the ball effectively. Special teams played really well, and the defense continued to press on and uh, you know came home with a shutout. And it's been quite a, quite some time since we've gotten a Big Ten shutout. So, you know, you combine all that together, uh, road win in the Big Ten, and uh, you know a chance to get our seventh win. Just really, really happy for our team. Really proud of uh, everybody's effort. Uh, chosen to defend the goal both halves in your in your coaching career. Uh, yeah, and. Uh, some of you guys may remember this, but no three, it didn't work out too well up in East Lansing. We took the wind and uh, gave them the ball, and they promptly drove it about 80 yards for eight up about eight minutes. So, <laughs> yeah, it was a double whammy there. But just, you know, this kind of wind, uh, you know, what it can do in the kicking game especially, just didn't want to take that chance today.